Stomp, stomp, stomp. Uh-oh. Good day, Dino friends, and welcome back to Jurassic Park! I'm sorry. I'm saying it like that because apparently this game has one, two, three, four, five, seven exclamation points in the name. So that's why I'm saying it like that. Anyway, yeah, today I'm again in this game. I'm confused. I'm still confused, you guys, because this is the most played Jurassic game out there and it has not that many things. So yeah, I'm back in this game, the most popular Jurassic Park game that exists in Roblox right now. And we're going to change that. We're going to try to become the most popular Jurassic Park fan game, or at least better than this one, because this one, look, the cars barely even works. Okay, let's let me try it. It doesn't how do you steal oh and it just disappeared. Someone stepped on the respawn button. Ah, this one I'm talking about. This game is just a mess, and my goal is to make a Jurassic Park game that's a little bit less of a mess, okay? So yeah, how do we make a game that's better than this? So obviously, this game is just a free model. You can actually get this entire map for free and make a game like this just with a few clicks because it's a free model. Everything that's in this game is free that you can get. You don't have to make anything yourself. So I've been thinking, how do you make one of these? yourself oh is a spider so yeah Ow. So I've been thinking, how can you make a game like this? Oh, I've got killed again. Are you serious? Okay, we'll just go to a private server. <laughs> okay, I made a private server, okay? I just don't want to get killed anymore. So why is this game so popular? I don't understand. That car doesn't work. The morphs sometimes work, not always. And apart from that, there's nothing here. So... If you can get this map for free, then why are there not other people who've taken this map and making it even better? So that's when I decided, why don't I do that? So here I am in Roblox Studio and I got a ton of different models, including the one where we're just playing. It's a free one. You can just get it. This map is free. I also got a bunch of other maps that you can get for free. So look at this. Let me zoom out. I have to zoom out so far. Look how big it is. I spent like... I spent like a whole day stitching all of these maps together and putting more and more free models in it just to see if we could make a bigger park. And it is so much bigger. There's so many more dinosaurs. And I was going to put so many more dinosaurs. I was going to put roads everywhere and guests and more buildings and hotels and everything just to see if people would play a game that's made out of just free things. And I think it would be a really cool game. The only problem, of course, most of you are already thinking it, is really full of viruses. So if you make a free Roblox game, if you use all these free models that you can get for free and you can drag into your game, if you put these in your game, there's a very high chance that they will have a virus. And of course, a lot of these things have viruses. So the game is pretty much unplayable. The viruses make the game so laggy that you cannot play. So that is really sad. I already spent a lot of time deleting most of the viruses, but there's still some left. And if I'm going to put more free models, more free dinosaurs and guests and whatever did I say buildings everything in it there's going to be even more viruses so I think we have to say that this plan has failed which is really sad because look at this beautiful giant map only this part not even this part but this part is where we just were that's how big the most popular jurassic park game in roblox is this big and this is how big our park would be at the very only at the start we could make it even bigger but no it's not possible there's too many glitches you guys i mean there's so much lag that's what i mean there's just so much lag but what i really like about this is that it's just so big so much room to build our own things so let's move on to my next idea so then i had the idea what if we just make a giant square and we build in it but i think that would be a little bit boring so i made just this giant square let's click play it's just because like this you cannot see how big it is let's go in it okay so look do you see 
see that little brown line over there? That's actually a wall that's like five times as tall as me. So you can imagine how big this map is, but it's a little bit boring. I mean, look at it. It's a little bit boring. There's nothing in it. And even if you would put stuff in it, there's not much to explore. I want to make a place where you can make caves and waterfalls and kind of secret places where you can find secrets. So yeah, this idea is a little bit boring. It's big. So at least that's one of my things, one of my problems solved, but I don't know because there's one more thing that I want. Let me actually show you guys. There's one more thing that I want. Okay, so here is the dino game that we made so far. You guys have probably already tried it maybe once. Um, there's not a lot of dinos in it yet. We were just messing around. It's a very small map. Uh, let's see, it has like a statue. It has some morphs that I tried to make. They don't really work. Uh, there's some teleports. There's a shop. Uh, and I was going to make some dinosaurs. But of course, it's really small. So problem number one, as I already said, is that it's really small. So I want a new map that's really big, but I also want one more thing and that is that I want to be able to make the map bigger as much as I want so instead of having a really big map right away a really big island for Jurassic Park like um, Isla Nublar real size something like that instead of that I kind of want something where you can make it bigger really easily because I already tried to make this bigger but the hard part is every time I try to make this map bigger I have to like move everything everything around. I have to like delete the walls and move them around and make the map like stretch the map, the floor, and then I have to like make I have to like move everything around. That's the problem uh, with this idea. So I kind of want a map where you don't have to move everything around. So how am I going to make that? Let's see, then here we have an actual copy that I made of the game that I'm in. Okay, so here's Roblox, right? So you can see the game where I'm in it. This is the most popular Roblox game right now. Uh, I thought, what if I just actually, instead of copying the model, which might have a virus in it, what if I like rebuild it? So I did that. I don't know why, I was just bored, okay? So here it is, it's an actual copy. It was done yet i was also going to put all of those giant trees and everything else but made by me instead of using free models uh, but i think this map has kind of an ugly shape so also no thank you then after that i had another look at isla nublar or actually this isn't i don't know if they're pretending it's isla nublar anyway this is the map from the official jurassic world event if you guys don't remember in 2018 uh when jurassic world fallen kingdom came out roblox had an event and they made a map that you could use to practice your building skills and it even says right here uh, join the creator challenge and learn how to use this blah 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 uh, welcome to volcanic island and it also said you are challenged to make a jurassic world game so that is perfect because i was actually scared can you make a jurassic world game don't you get like su sued by them i don't know don't you get in trouble but you can't because they they challenge you to actually make a Jurassic World game. It's right here. So I thought, what if we use this island that they have given us? But the only problem is I don't really like terrain like this. Like I like to make the world out of blocks and not out of this stuff, this terrain. So then I thought, how do I make it? Then I guess I will have to make my own island. I guess? I don't know, you guys. I've been thinking about this so long. So then I made this island. So this is an island made out of blocks really quickly. Pretty simple island, really big. It has three, well, floors, you could say. So this is where the boat arrives. I would make maybe like a pier and the boat arrives. And then maybe here you have hotels. And then here you have some dinosaurs and there you have some more dinosaurs. Maybe. I don't know. I like the idea of islands though, because if you have not just one island like in Jurassic Park, but multiple islands, that solves my problem. That actually solves my problem. Because if you have multiple islands, then you can just keep adding more. That solves my problem. My problem was, 
if you have a map, how do you like expand it? Because you have to like remake the entire map to expand it. You have to like move everything around. And that is such a hassle. That's 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 just a lot of work and very confusing. But if you have multiple islands and you need more space, you can just make another island. That's it. That's the answer. I think that's the answer. We have to make multiple islands. But then I thought of one more thing. I had one last idea, you guys. What if we use flying islands? So that is when I made... Actually, I don't think I have it made into a game right now. But I made it into a model. So let's see, where's that model that I made? Last Sunday in a live stream, I designed my first floating island. Don't make fun of me, okay, guys? Here it is. Here it is, my first floating island. I know it's not perfect. But it's the first one I've ever made, okay? I was just practicing last Sunday. Thank you everyone who was there watching last Sunday. We have made this island and I really like it. Because now, let's say if we are out of space on this island, we can just make another one. And we can be like, no, this one has to be smaller. Or we use a bunch of small ones and they will be the bridge to another... To another island that is super big like that we can now make the park as big or as small as we want and we can have different floating islands for all the different things we can have maybe even one per dinosaur i think i won't do one per dinosaur maybe we'll have one island per group of dinosaurs like one for ceratopsians one island for sauropods one island for carnivores or something i don't know we're definitely going to have like a separate island for the hotel and all of that i i think this could work you guys we're going to make our own Jurassic World Dino Park on floating islands. That is, that is, I've never seen that before. I don't know if anyone's done that before. Probably, maybe. I don't know, but I've never heard of a dino park on floating islands. This, you guys, this is the answer to our problems. And also, of course, we need to make one change to the game because we want it to be popular, right? So, we have to give it seven exclamation points. Ah, no, of course it's tags. It's tags. Okay, so for some reason, Roblox hate the word dino. I'm not even kidding. Like, they half of the time it's tags. I don't know why. Let's tr try. Dino. Dino Park. There we go. Dino Park. They hate dino parks. Roblox hates dino parks. Why do they hate dino parks? I don't really know. Dinosaur Park? Would that work? Please tell me that works. <gasps> it works! Jurassic World Dinosaur Park. There we go. Now that's the title that you want with seven... Wait, let's see. One, two, three. We got seven exclamation point. Let's have the visitors come to us so we can have a lot of visitors just like this game. Um, I think it's going to work, you guys. Sorry that in this video I haven't really done anything. Let's make a dino park on floating islands, you guys. If you guys have any ideas for me to make my own Jurassic Park, leave them in the comments. I will use you guys' ideas in the videos, okay? So leave your best ideas in the videos. We're going to make a big Jurassic Park. Wait, what did I call it? Jurassic World Dino Park. Because I want it to be called Jurassic Park and Jurassic World, okay? So it's called Ju Jurassic World Dino Park. And if you want to play, then there will be a link in the description. And yeah, I'm going to start making some more floating islands. And some will have dinosaurs on them. If you have any ideas, let me know. I will put one of you guys' ideas in the next video. That's it. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to stomp like a dinosaur. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Uh-oh.